Well, both teams look like they're playing a match-up style defense. Not straight man-to-man, -man, but they are covering areas. Who is now your everyday starter. Only started three times last year here for the Terps. And here's a takeaway by Owusu. They feed Diamond Miller again, and she's got a quick four points. Nelson takes it again. That time it won't fall. Yeah, I mean, Brenda Freeze last year arguably coming off one of her better defensive teams. And there's the first bucket by Angel Reese, one of the 10 players averaging 12 plus minutes per game. Right, and that makes it tough to practice. Coach Freeze said, hey, we have to have some coaches come out there and practice with us because our numbers are low. You know, if you would feel the same way back in the day. So I just, I love the confidence and the bold spirit. Absolutely, an and one finish there for Benson. Rutgers defense almost forcing the turnover, then underneath, Chloe Bibby putting it up, can't score, but then gets her own rebound, puts it in. And draws the foul, a chance for a three-point play. In the corner, this is Shanice Lewis who takes the shot, can't score. Back to Miller, Miller dumps inside, it's put up and in. Mimi Collins lays it in and draws the foul, so a chance for a three-point play. Advantage of second chance points, Bibby gets the rebound. Good feed here from Diamond Miller. 16-14. Just over two minutes remaining here in the first. Long three-point shot, good! That's Katie Benzin, an outstanding three-point shooter. Russo loses, stolen by Johnson. Diamond Johnson lays it up, and it's blocked from behind by Diamond Miller. Miller has, in that situation, his height advantage. Great job by Lafayette forcing the steal. Johnson was trying to create contact here. but Rutgers up by three, 42-39. Diamond Miller ties the game! And the first half comes to an end. What a spectacular first half. And then Diamond Miller, the top scorer, saucing him up. A three to tie the game, Lou. All of this year. Now here's Benzin, fakes the three, goes inside. Now back to Owusu, step back, behind the back, dribbling. She knocks down the mid-range jumper. And Maryland's off to an early lead. Big sophomore jump in the first five games of the year so far. Now here is Bibby, the Mississippi State transfer, and she knocks down the three. Three-point sharpshooter for the Terps. And now Owusu on it. Owusu driving down a hill. The shot, the foul was called. So Owusu drove left. It was fouled by Juf, it looked like. Maybe Tucker got a hand in there, so we're waiting the call as the officials meet. And Masonis gets the rebound. Quick outlet to Owusu. Now Bibby driving down low. The foul and the basket for Chloe Bibby is able to get Bibby the bucket. Yeah, that's the best thing. When you're a post and you can run with those guards, that, that puts pressure on those guards to pick up their pace, right? But she's a phenomenal athlete with a high basketball IQ on the floor. Well, they can't settle just for those outside shots, those contested threes, those aren't high percentage shots, and that's a high percentage shot. They can score multiple ways. All three levels, they have viable players who can score for them. And they can play defense, too. Benson, ooh, she pulled up. Final few seconds here of the quarter. Awusu, then the offensive threat, and she's got a new career high with the final bucket of the quarter. Defending champs in the Big Ten against the preseason favorites to win it for just the second time in school history. Both sides coming in without a loss so far in Big Ten play. Maryland strikes first. Defense against the Hoosiers for the early lead. Has made a big leap forward this year. And for the two Terps, uh, Owusu is coming off a career high performance. They share the ball, they move it. They are one of the best at throwing us. You can come with some three quarter pressure and try to make you go deeper into the shot clock. Looking around the burger. And they will turn it over. Wusu head up. Wusu coming off the screen. She's got it. Steps back, loses the defender, pulls up and hits. And may have literally turned the ankle of the defender, Jalen Penn. Wusu, if you haven't been watching, turn in to the fourth quarter. Because she is turning it up. They've hit their last five shots. Now can they do it on this end? Collins. Cut. The cut to the bucket for Collins. Count it. Defender turned her head 
Jordan was ball watching. Watch this. Diamond Miller's defender turns their head and she goes right to the basket. And one Maryland Terrapin team against an 8 0 Michigan State team. Hasn't dropped a game yet this year. And off of the tip, they find Miller. Good uh, possession there for the Terps to start. The tip, you see Maryland working it around to Miller. Someone forgot about it. Yeah, Robin mishandling it and losing the ball that time. Finding a cutting Mimi uh, Collins for two. Certainly the hot hand for Maryland in the first couple minutes of this one. Owusu, the hot hand on the season, the reverse, and it's in. Cheeky little move there from Ashley Owusu. Here is Katie Benson, first time we said her name so far. Pass down low, in through traffic, Owusu is there to put it off the glass. To go baseline, puts it up, had it knocked out cleanly. It falls to Faith Masonis, two to shoot. Styles at the buzzer, got it! The plays, right? But the one thing that Styles has is experience. Slow start here for the Terps. Benson, another try. Her second attempt, her third attempt, and she makes that three point fall. And we've seen actually, ooh, Miller with the block from behind. We're off the ball on that block. Diamond Miller playing some staunch defense early on here. Just what Brenda Freeze wants to see, a balanced effort. And there is Owusu who knocks it down. Maryland looking to stay perfect in Big Ten play. Two seconds on the shot clock. Owusu, nothing but net. Comes out of the water and shows her shark fin. and <laughs> Pulls up to mid-range. All net for Ashley Owusu. Pospisch Olova lost the handle. Owusu pounces on it. There's Chloe Bibby with the cleanup and the put in. Little one to two press and they go back to man to man. Owusu so strong, gets the ball, aggressive fighting for it. Bibby on the other end, finishing with contact. Hilliard with the extra pass. And the reverse is missed by the freshman Brooke Schrammick, but a gorgeous feed from Hilliard. Chloe Bibby already has 10 points. Mimi steps into one, short, and Faith Masonis with the offensive rebound and putback to end the third quarter. They're not going to foul. They have to stay on the floor. These five players for Maryland and these five for Ohio State have to play significant minutes. The free started going, instead of score stop, it was score steal. And that was their mentality defensively, and they brought it again this season as well. Booty, the transfer from Mississippi State, does a good job of attacking. No way are they getting sped up. They're comfortable running what they want when they have to slow the game down. Deep three ball is good. Owusu able to tip it to herself. Very good rebounding guard. Drops it off for the shooter. Another free look for Benzin. She's three of three from deep. Did a fantastic job right here in transition. Just spot up deep. Man, what a week for the Buckeyes of Ohio State. An upset of Michigan, an upset of Maryland. They take down a pair of top ten foes. Start of a road trip for Wisconsin. They play Penn State later. They'll actually be in Maryland until Saturday. And not a good start for Wisconsin. Chloe Bibby. Close position in a 4-2 Husker lead. Quickly up the floor, Chloe Bibby with the three. 33% from behind the arc on the year for the senior from Australia and a 5-4 Maryland advantage. And outside. Chloe Bibby with the ability to knock it from three. Such an inch. Miller switching to the left hand all the way into the rack. And Diamond Miller thought she should get an and one, but she gets two there, her first two. Release point, but it's hard to guard, hard to close out on. Then Diamond Miller able to get to the basket. An O run in the blink of an eye for Maryland as Nebraska tries to secure it for the turnover. Instead, a live ball turnover to Katie Benson, and Benson to the other end lays it in. Look for Hybe, could not connect. Bibby will start it up the floor to Miller. Diamond Miller in transition on the run down the left side of the lane for two more. Hybe, five seconds, four seconds. It's rid of it. Brown with one second rejected by Bibby, and we've reached the end of quarter number one. She's got three this year. Benzin, her second of the game. 
And watch Benzin. Look, Terry has her hands down. That's enough space, enough. Uh, doesn't much matter, however. Maryland gets the ball back anyway. And Collins, before the horn, drops it in. Again, you mentioned the savant-like passing ability for Ashley Owusu. Selfish play, giving the ball inside Masonis. Masonis making a move, starting facing up, taking a dribble. Miller dribbles into the front court. Miller to the foul line. Dishes off beautifully to Chloe Bibby. Lays it in. Just like that, the Terps are on top. Al in the backcourt. Pal dribbling up toward midcourt, still in the backcourt. One-handed sloppy pass up ahead, stolen away by Collins. Collins to Owusu, wide open for the easy lay-in. Dribbling top of the key, backs her way out behind the arc. Pass in the front to Collins. Collins back to Owusu. Owusu spin move in the lane. Her shot goes, and she's fouled. He has got incredible range as a shooter. The tip goes to Maryland. Talk about range and time, and Miller sizing it up for three. Miller again, she's got the first three. She's got all six points here so far. Two teams starting out red hot, 60% shooting for Maryland, 67% shooting for Iowa in their first couple of possessions. Benson, how about it? You bet. The first three point miss for either one of these teams. You saw that graphic. They started out a perfect five for five. Miller taking the contact. A three point play the old fashioned way. And then Miller, Wears number one on her jersey, and this is an and one right here, drawing contact. Coming with some full court pressure to try to slow this Terrapin team down. Owusu pulls up for a long jumper that's no good. Inside, Nini Collins with the rebound, back off to Miller. Miller's gonna fire a three-pointer, and that one's good. Benson back the other way for the Terrapins. Off to Bibby, who spins away from Layden, gets it down to Owusu. She's working in the post against Farquhar, goes up for a reverse layup and scores. Back the other way, here's Owusu with a runner that's no good. Farquhar rebounds to Trailer. Purdue coming two on two. Trailer has more on her right. Trailer goes up to the basket and has the shot blocked out of bounds by Diamond Miller. This is that the rebound's tipped out near midcourt to Benzin with four seconds. Back off to Owusu. Here's Reese for a three from the left side. Good. Angel Reese hits a triple right before the buzzer. Back out on top to Trailer. KT working out there against Miller, throws to Dumbia. Dumbia drives the middle, her shot was blocked by Bibby. Awusu spins away and she comes into the front court, four on two. Says that, was, that was her first three point. Yes, it was. Game. They get it down low to Goni. Goni working in the post, goes up on the left. That shot is swatted away by Reese and here comes Maryland the other way. Their first season, they basically played at a high school as Walsh Ryan Arena was being renovated. <laughs> they go from that to winning a Big Ten championship. At the end of that last conversation, we all know this, that if you were given a sixth or seventh year of eligibility, you would have jumped at that. You would still be playing at Coastal Carolina. You would have been another Big South Player of the Year candidate. Halfway through our second quarter, so a lot has changed in a short period of time. We'll see. It was funny talking to head coach Brenda Freeze about that. It's like, well, what, what exactly do you go in and tell the team? Here's a steal. Veronica Burton leads the country in that category. She's off to the races and swatted away. Who else? Diamond Miller. Runner off the mark by Sydney Wood. Maryland controls. Diamond Miller, Euro step. Left handed no finish high off the glass. Oh my goodness. This is maybe SC top 10 worthy here. That's between three defenders. What concentration. She starts the ball. Force them to shoot that shot, that three point shot. And here's Benson, who we know can shoot that three-point shot. One luck, one bucket. Well, transition buckets are for the taking for Maryland. If you do not locate Katie Benson, she's going to knock in three after three. She called that quick timeout to quell things. Well, she was watching Maryland do that to Iowa, and she's watching a perfect three-for-three three start here for this Maryland Terrapin team. It's Chloe Bibby hitting her first three. And that's three different people who have scored. And the steal and the takeaway, Awusu for the easy two. And even after that timeout, the Terps just keep coming and coming. Well, it's not good enough to stand in front of Maryland when they're trying to rebound the ball. You've got to wedge yourself in and put a body and a back on somebody and have two high hands. Mimi Collins!